when you were just speaking to the to women who yeah. are um who are in the industry, yeah, I thought about Rahab. So I'm going to speak to a woman right now who yeah. may know nothing about the Bible. Yes. You may think, where do I fit in Jesus' story? Well, yeah. guess what? In the lineage of Jesus, there's a woman named Rahab, right? Who was a prostitute? Yeah. Who um who was used to um her. God used her. She had faith in God, even though she yeah. was not part of God's original family. Yes. She had faith in the Lord. And because of her faith, she saved, she was not only saved, but her whole family was saved. Then right. she was brought into God's family. And then, and she ended up in God's family line. Right. And one of the men, for the women that don't know about the Bible, there's a man named Boaz. And there's right. a lot of single women that are like, I want a Boaz. <laughs> right. It's a, this right. godly man. Exactly. And his mother was Rahab. Yes, yes. His mother was Rahab. So just God is able to Amen. do beyond what you could ever imagine. Yes. And and you you can open up your Bible if you don't know anything about it and go to the Old Testament I believe it was in um, Joshua, mm -hmm. the book of Joshua, and find a woman that has a similar story to you. Yes. Amen. I just wanted to share that Amen. with you. Yeah. That, and then she ended up being in the family line of, of Christ. Amen. And so right. I just want you to know that God sees you like Anne said, but yeah. you're also a part of his story. Amen. Yes. 